Thanks to their ability to be printed on large area flexible foils, organic semiconductors are promising candidates for next generation electronic applications, like smartphones and TVs. However, these materials grow in an amorphous way, or by forming millions of little crystals called polycrystalline. This factor reduces their electric conductivity, making them much less efficient than classic, fully crystalline semiconductors. With his groundbreaking research, IMEX Paul Herrimans proposes a radical shift in the production of organic semiconductor films in order to develop high-performance electronic devices, displays and solar cells. In our project, we introduced innovative techniques to generate more uniform, more crystalline organic semiconductors in order to boost the charge transport, thus increasing electric conductivity. As there isn't one unique technique that can fit all materials, we implemented several methods to reach that goal, each of them applicable to specific classes of organic semiconductors. The first technique consisted of applying heat to recrystallize a thin, amorphous molecular film and then using that new crystal as a template to grow more identical molecules up to the desired film thickness while keeping the crystal structure. We were able to demonstrate this in organic solar cells. In transistors and light emitting devices, we developed a tool that coats a film from solution at the exact speed of the growth of an ideal crystal. <laughs>